And what would you say about the weather and the climate change and what Greta Thunberg well, said? OK, so my big question is, who is Greta Thunberg? She's not a climatologist. She's not a scientist. She's a media event. She's the spokesperson of somebody else, clearly. And for anybody to claim otherwise, I'm merely being disingenuous. I, 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 would, I would say she maybe has not passed the exams to be classed as a climatologist, but I would say she knows as much as many of them do. I, I would challenge that completely. Right, OK. Absolutely challenge that. And okay. I think it's... Give it as a, an 18-year-old who's been proven that when she's asked a direct question, and let's make it clear, she wasn't asked this question and she came out. This is clearly a speech she has rehearsed. I think she was asked her. about it, wasn't it? She was asked a yeah, direct asked question. Yeah, by, by a placed questioner. Oh. I'm an actor by trade. Are I you? know how, what, what it sounds like. Yeah, I'm a voice actor, so I understand these things. She's clearly learnt a response. She doesn't know. She's an 18-year-old. She doesn't know. She's not a child anymore. So she doesn't have the protection of being, I'm a child, how dare you criticise me? She doesn't know what she's talking about. She's clearly a spokesman. So I want to know who she is. Look, you, you, you're clearly, you're, I wouldn't say angry, but you're clearly a little agitated about this. Why are you getting so wound up by what she says? Well, I'm getting wound up by the fact that people are running after this child saint who's no longer a child, as if she's an authority. She's not an authority. She's done no research. But what she said today not, is actually true, isn't it? How do you know it's true? Well, because everyone you speak to who, who is everyone qualified... Everyone you speak to, everybody you speak everybody I know, I'm sure in the LBC office, everybody you know thinks so. Well, given, and given the people... Is she, not, that, is no, she no, not right saying that we calculate our carbon footprint in a slightly disingenuous way? Because we don't include aviation how would, and we don't include... How would I, know and how would you know how would i, I don't know i guess i read you, a bit no you don't know oh. no you don't know oh. and i don't know either i don't know either <laughs> All right. but we're expected to believe the child messiah because yeah, but you you don't you, as an actor you don't know she's wrong i don't know she's wrong but right. what i'm rejecting is this we must automatically believe her in her attack on boris johnson who i'm no fan of by the way right right right, right. but we must automatically believe her because the messiah has spoken even though she's not an expert in any way so what I want to hear from, I want to hear from scientists who's telling us this. Why? Why? Not okay. So, okay. Uh, let me. Let me. Let me come at this from a different angle. Then, why is it you think that so many respected scientists, politicians, world leaders do listen to her? No, I don't think they do. Of course they do. No, they no. Of course they do, and you know, of course they do, because everybody you know says so. No, she's a so useful voice. She goes. She she's goes to useful. climate conferences. She's treated like you know royalty. <laughs> Yes, she is, because she's such a great media personality. How could you have no, it No, there's got to be a, substance. A little, girl, a little girl who sticks her tongue out. At, at, no, at no, Bush, come on, bed. you're being completely unfair. You're, you're basically no, saying not. she's just no, a cartoon pantomime figure who doesn't know that's what she's exactly talking what, about. If she really exactly didn't know, what if think. she was talking total and utter rubbish, do you honestly think that she would have pride of place in front of, I don't know, the whole EU conference in, in Brussels? On, right. <laughs> I realise as soon as I get any, you're going to cut it's me off. It's fine. No, I'm not going to cut you off. I'm enjoying yeah, your you enthusiasm, you Thor, cut, and your name. You're going to cut me off. Yeah. The moment I get there, you're going to cut me off. But I'm anyway, not. let's get to it. So, get your how does a girl with... Isn't it strange? Because her parents do the same job I do. They're actors. But they're activists. I'm not an activist, but they're activists. And quite, quite famously... <laughs> I mean, you can tell by my surname, I'm part Scandinavian, so they're very famous in Sweden. Well, what's your actually. surname? I've only got you down as Thor. Oh, Halland, H-A-L-L-A-N-D. OK, fun. Like Ingall okay. and Halland, yeah. Yes, right. So they're quite famous as activists, and isn't this amazing that these activists suddenly have this child who's, oh, she has a, a, a strike. Kids do strikes around London all the time, they do all sorts of things. They <laughs> magically... Gets to speak before the UN. How do you get to speak before the UN? Who gets to invite you? How did that happen? Do you, do, OK, let me ask you one other question. Is there not a part of you that admires the fact that she wanted to attend a conference in, I think it was the United States, it may have been South America, but she crossed the Atlantic on a sailboat? Does, does not anything apart about that make you think, wow, <laughs> she's different? That's fabulous. So... It gets set up for her to go out over the sailboat. Don't you admire her for, for sticking by her? Hang on, hang on. No, oh. no, no, come on. Come on, then. Don't do a James O'Brien on All me. All right. Come on, 
Look, come on, don't be a James O'Brien. Oh. You know, let me speak back. What's that? She, whatever major event was that, and to have the carbon footprint, she wasn't flying over. However, her crew was all flown back. All right, and let me go so back to my was... original question, Thor. Why are you so agitated about this? Because in the end, does it really matter that much? Somebody who knows nothing about something is taken as an authority because she was once a child. I was once a child. Well, I'm not sure it's as simple as that. I think the message that she's giving obviously strikes a chord with people. Okay. She's Look, making a message, and she's a good media person. All right, listen, I get, we, got we, you all twisted I'm around not, her head. I'm not closing you down for any other reason, Thor, than it's getting, coming to three o'clock. I want to get one other opinion. Okay, happy with that? Okay, then. Not closing all you right, down, then. not shutting you down.